I need someone to show me my place in all this. There's nothing better than to start off a Star Wars game than from the to hear from Ray, everyone's favourite Star Wars character. Anyways, hello everyone and welcome to Lego Star Wars Skywalker Saga. It's finally out. I have no idea how fucking long it's been out for. I think it's been like a few weeks. Uh, but I finally got it. And, oh my god, Jar Jar Binks abuse by fucking, fucking Rose Tico. Alright, this game is not getting my good box already. Everyone, you know, everyone's praising this game. Everyone's heralding it as the best fucking game ever since the complete saga. Um, yeah, that's, that's as far as I got up to. Yep, fucking erase that shit. Uh, I, I didn't finish the first level. Everyone says it's really good, so I'm gonna be I'm gonna be playing a bit, a bit of Devil's Advocate right now. First of all, I'm just gonna go back to the main menu because I just want to say, what? Oh fuck's sake! Fucking loading. Okay, first of all, I know it's short. Fucking loading screens, but so y it starts off with Ray, who no one wants to hear from. Right? What is more epic, this with the the little atmospheric music. Or the opening screen of the complete saga. Which is action packed. And it just it screams Star Wars. Also, it just the, it just looks a lot cheaper, does like the UI of the, I'm pretty sure UI. But the I like the little gag beams. That are going on on the screen right now. We've got all the characters. But th this shit at the bottom, it kind of just looks cheaper. And this, it just looks better in the old game. You know, it's that, because it's, the complete saga is the third oldest console licensed Lego game. So it uses that original style. And, and this is purely opinion. So this is just me being a nitpicky fuck, but it just looks a lot better, really. All right, okay. So then we've we fog on cuz apparently, I don't know shit about this game by the way. This is a um level level picking episode selection loading screen. So we've got all nine episodes because apparently the sequels I well, I guess they couldn't not include them. You know, that that would be probably a clear demonstration of fucking bias i just don't think this is i know because apparently this is a more open world kind of sort of game where you can move around between different planets apparently you can free roam in between levels which i actually really like because one of my favorite lego games uh, lego marvel superheroes which is probably the only one that i've come even close to 100 percenting. i have to redo all that now because my xbox account that i had that data on is no longer there but anyways um, that res really restricts you from free roaming ma around Manhattan. You can't do it, basically, until you've, like, completed the story. Because you can't, like, change characters and shit. But, so that that seems what they've what they've done. So, I guess it won't really make sense to have the Star Wars, uh, to have the cantina bit, the Mos Eisley cantina. But I don't know, there's something about it that's just, like... I guess this is a different kind of game. I'm going to start with Phantom Menace, obviously. Django Fett Starship. Yep, that's fucking it. <coughs> Don't believe these Disney lies. It's the fucking Slave 1. And it will always be the Slave 1. Uh, this is literally the opening. This is an unskippable um, MOV file to Episode 1. They don't. Uh, I guess they're not going to do the thing like they did in um, the the cl c Complete Saga. And I'm, I'm very sorry... If you're gonna get mad at comparing this game to the um, to the complete saga, stop watching the series right now. Stop watching this video because that's gonna be happening a lot whilst the Congress. This is stupid. The problem with the Phantom Menace is the plot, the backstory, the plot doesn't make any fucking sense. What is it in the film? It's kind of solid. You know, I'm of the I'm, so This is definitely Devil's Advocate. I'm of the opinion that in the original six Star Wars films. They're all not inherently bad films. And I, th I think two is worse than one. Because two's boring as fuck. Uh, whereas there's a lot of a lot of good potential in uh, episode one. And for the most part, because I know there is a bubble mode, but I am going to be uh, doing dialogue. Because uh, I want to see how it works. The ambassadors for the Supreme Chancellor request permission to board. Uh, nice uh, ooh, ooh, uh, Evil plans. Oh. Yes, of course. 
As you know, a blockade is perfectly legal. I don't really like you, Gumray. I don't, I don't like the um the new Lego set kind of one. I think there was a, like one of a minifigure of him. For, oh, I'm gonna have to go through this stupid fine tutorial, anyways. So um so use right trigger to turn it around. Uh, right stick to turn it around. You can use the bump. Oh my god! You can use the bumpers to barrel roll. Um, the trigger shoot. You speed up using that. So you can do all sorts of shit. You can't really turn around at, at the same time as um. You kind of can, but it kind of don't work. All right. Okay. So now I've successfully given everyone. Uh, motion sickness, so let's just get bearings. Let's get into this fucking game. Alright. Can I start shooting the Trade Federation? What happens if I crash? Oh. Alright. Uh, yes, I would like to land here. So, first level General Grievous's Soulless One. Uh, I was not aware that it was called the Soulless One. I do, however, I'm going to say this. Although I do like the uh, the mum, I do kind of like that title interface. That reminds me a lot of like Zelda games in the way they do uh, some some of those games do their areas. Um, how do I change characters? Oh, all right. I'm used to it being Y from like the Xbox, but it's right uh, bumper. All right, uh, R1. So that's kind of cool. Um, we're just getting straight into things. There's no, there's no starting room. We're not starting in the actual um, interrogation room, uh, diplomatic room. Sorry, like like we did in the uh, complete saga. Um, as far as I know, uh, oh yeah. By the way, I think the studs look like kind of. I guess cheap is the word that I'm thinking of. They they look like. Yeah, they look kind of cheap, I would say. It looks like some kind of weird, like, mobile game sort of thing. I don't know, because I'm a bit confused about like how to feel about this game so far. I guess I'll have to play more before I properly judge it. Uh, it doesn't seem there's really massive benefit into... Hello, TC14. Unfortunately, I can't fucking kill her. Even though we've, like, lit... Oh. I'll be, I'll be cool. Quite got Jen's looking out for this sauce. Yeah, don't be, don't be fucking alarmed, protocol robot. That I, that I've got have a laser sword. I do prefer the mumbles. I like the mumbling, but something that I like about and bearing in mind, I, I really like um. Oh my god. Okay, I didn't realize you lost as many studs as this. But yeah, um. What am I trying to say? Uh, I really like. Huh. Yeah, I'll just get rid of that. I don't think anyone needs to see that. Just like these studs. Yeah, I do like I do like the mumbling. I feel like they give uh, an extra kind of personality to the Lego games. But I and I really really don't like the just taking like film clips. That's why I think that's partly the reason why I think Lego Avengers and Lego Jurassic World are just completely. Uh, what the f- Oh, I just made that spontaneously combust. Can I do that with the force? Hey. Yeah, I think they're, they're just- so, they're, That helps them be just really subpar games. Um, but I do like the choice for original voice acting. Targeted objects with the force. This is a different kind of game, and I think I just need to accept that this is going to be- Hey. Oh fuck! Oh no! It sounds like a fucking space earthquake. Oh god! Oh. Oh first, I like the pause menu. I guess they'll probably be different depending on the um the trilogy. Okay, so it's teaching me how to do a. Uh... So you just keep pressing different buttons essentially. So. Square X, square X, square X, square. So that's what you can do. Square X. But realistically, you probably won't get that. Can I like? 
Oh. All right, I don't like I don't like the red things on their head. I just need to. I didn't mean to knock that. Yeah. What I like about Lego Marvel Avenge Super Lego Marvel Super is a game version of a comic book. It's got a completely original story with a bunch of Marvel characters, and I like that they've got original voice actors. What I like about this is that they've gone for the best of both worlds. You've got the mumble mode, but you've also got non-film, um, non-film audio, uh, which apparently has a lot of people from the Clone Wars, uh, which I guess, yeah, I guess this is like a, this is. What I th what I thought and ha and I guess still do think going into this is that this is a yeah I didn't mean to do that uh, I meant to pick it fucking up is that this is a this is a Star Wars game uh, for the fans the the people who will still put up with Star Wars's bullshit or people who still feel some sort of joy and any emotion that it isn't apathy for the series which is a, a reduced amount or people who just want to play a fucking cool lego game um i haven't like the the most recent lego game that i've actually played is uh lego marvel superheroes 2 and that one was a lot more traditional a lot of a lot more in line with the other ones so um unless DC super unless DC super villains is like this game then this is like a completely uh new direction and it seems that instead of button mashing for the um for the combat which is basically just what the original games are uh well like all of the original Lego games this one is more uh Arkham combat you say about it what you will Arkham combat is fucking cool Well, I can't do that. Am I? What am I drawing right now? Oh, <laughs> okay. I was supposed to cut into it. See, so like triangle is sort of like a, a counter. I'm trying to pick it up. Can I just pick it up? What are you talking about? I literally killed myself. So it's a bit like it's like a heavy attack. Different kinds of attacks. When you're in combat, it's like a, it's like a, it's not like exactly the same as the Arkham combat, but it's got the same kind of feel to it. Uh, I'm supposed to be going through here, aren't I? I like how you, get, uh, I like how you get progressively faster. Oh, it's oh, I wouldn't have liked to have seen that. All right, continue story. Yeah. Oh, wait, wait that's not what they look. Where is it? Yeah, I, I, the fuck you come res dead, bro. Jab, jab, binks. I know what that is. Hey, oh fuck. Mister Jar Jar Binks, Mister your humble servant. Okay, please, Jar Jar. Oh no, we're playing Jar Jar. The most safest place would be Otagonga. It's a hidden city. Okay, the person who's playing Jar Jar has got kind of a... Their, their impression is only mildly a bit better than mine. And mine's like, Miss I got Jar Jar Pinks. So that's fucking terrible. Oh, it's a big animal. Let's kill the fucking... Bit. Oh my god. Wait. Oh, alright. That could have all just been a cutscene. Where's the... Oh, fuck. I like how animated they are. Yeah, I think I think I'm gonna do like a counter for this this playthrough where it's like, oh, uh, and I know what that is. Count. Um, so number like in the in the jokes. So like the joke is, oh. All right. Okay. I've been late to Gunga City. Time to start massacring people. I kind of don't like. Oh, you can't like kill uh, the people, kill your allies. Also, I'm just getting. There doesn't seem. To, there's not like any motivation, really, for getting studs or like um, counter. I think it's true Jedi in the um, in the complete saga. I'm not too sure. I know it's true believer in Marvel superheroes, but uh, 
Uh, yeah, oh, yeah, I was going to say, I really like how, because LEGO games are such like a cartoony, stylized um, sort of game, that we've gotten to the point in the year 2022 where a lot of things can sort of have the, the LEGO aesthetic, because it was all over that, um, all over the Trade Federation uh, ship, the interior of that. Um, Is there something you want to tell us, Jar Jar? Where's Jar Jar? I might have been banished. I've forgotten. He sounds like that fucking. Like something it would have been helpful to remember. D what the fuck? Brainless. Oh my god, Qui Gon Jinn's best, bro. Calling Jar Jar a fucking idiot. Can't, this is something you can't use in Story. Oh, it's an Azdromech um, thing where R two D two sticks his robotic penis in. Right, I don't really think I want to go near that. So, although a lot of this hasn't got like a Lego aesthetic, a lot of the Trade Federation ship. Because that that's um, like one of the big things about a lot of um, older Lego games. Well, Lego games for a long time. I think it was really up until the uh, Lego Movie video game, where uh, there was just a lot of like other rendered backgrounds and environments, kind of like this one, I guess, um, in like Gunga City. But I think it's nice now that. We can have a lot of Lego stuff. It makes it feel more like a Lego game, rather we're just Lego characters in a world. People make their nest on anything. Yeah, I don't. I, I, I didn't ever need to hear female Gonga, and now I, I now I've heard it. I don't even think rumor. What there's rumors? What? I have no clue how that shiny get up there. She's a strange one for sure. Don't oh shiny. Where? Where? What is shiny? Rumor unlocked. All right, I don't, I don't need this right now. We shall no like Dadabu. We must warn them. What are you, retardant? Did he even? Ow! Fuck my arm. Did he even use his mind powers? I didn't see. I'm trying to prevent my PC. Oh shit! So that is the video. Uh, my fucking computer died whilst we're making this, so I have got back, and I guess we'll start off next episode wherever. Uh, maybe going to get the bongo. Maybe not. No idea. It's the joy of fucking living, I guess. Um, what do I think about the game so far? Okay, well, it's I've done the first. It's not even really levels. There's like missions, so it is, it is completely different. Don't expect. If you're going into this, don't expect this to be like a bigger a remake or a bigger version of the complete saga. Because that's not what you'll find in the Skywalker saga. Um, I wouldn't say it's ne necessarily better or worse, uh, but it's just kind of different. Definitely, it's strange Earth from what I thought it would be. But, you know, it's, it's like the ancient parable goes. Uh, man never judges game completely based on... The first, I guess I only played it for like properly for about like 20 minutes. Let's TV a game journalist. So I'm not saying that I hate it or anything. It's definitely a fun game. And at the end of the day, it doesn't have to be Complete Saga. Complete Saga still exists. I can always go play that. But it is fun so far. Are you retarded? It's time to play this. Oh, that's good. There's my glasses case. Shouldn't lose that. Have chickens on the hiccups. Oh fuck. Somebody help me. <laughs> Fake intro. Skip. Why's the control vibration for that? Why is the subtitle so big? Hey, Yoda. Whenever the game is saving, make sure to not play it. US, what? Wait, what? Where is it actually gonna play the credits? As soon as I. Oh. We can't play this on YouTube. It... What? Really? Okay, so you. Alright. So skip that. You've gotta press both the, the control sticks. Oh, I can't believe that. It's gonna play the entire plot, the entire setup. I presume that's the. I, I mean, I would get it if it was like. The complete saga. Oh, okay, I'll crash in the game now. I would get if it was like the complete saga and it is different, and it it tells you the different parts of the plot. 
because there's new title crawls for each level. But that's just gonna tell you about the. Well, this maybe it is different ones, but I really doubt it. Um. I bet it's just the one from the film where it's like the Trade Federation. It's like, okay, but now we're in a big bubble planet. Oh, it's guiding me to the... Oh, okay, so not only does it have... There's not even ghost studs. Not even ghost studs. There's circular platforms as well as... as there's every kind of indication. I get having... Oh, mission. Qui-Gon's in cape. Does he ever not wear a cape? Obi-Wan, episode one, Jar Jar Binks. Does anyone ever have separate Jar Jar Binks input direction? That was fucking stupid. Oh my god, okay, no, I'm... Those subtitles are way too big. Oh, just wait, display options. Can I turn on objective text? Okay, I'm gonna have it always on because otherwise I might forget. Objective waypoint arrows, regions, arrows leading to your. Okay, I yeah, I just want to disable the arrows. It's completely unnecessary. But now I. Oh, it'll be an audio, won't it? Title text. Small. Okay, when it's in boxes. Alright, I'm gonna have it in medium when it's in boxes. Subtitle text, it's gonna be small. Hey, that's a lot better. The fuck? What was that? I thought he like spun around, but it was a bigger fish. Yes, please. I thought he was like spinning around, like, th like 360ing up the stairs, but that was probably just because it was moving. It confused me. Too much motion confused me. Oh, it's big fish. One thing that is a definite improvement over the, the complete saga. Also, we're still looking out for things that we. Uh, I'm still looking out for things that you laugh because you know Star Wars. Huge old teeth. Don't worry. The force will guide us. No, it's fuck. Oh, I'm shooting rockets. OPC killer. <laughs> Alright, I kind of like this, um, the big fish kill the OPC killer. Oh, sh Is that a mini kit? I had to get that. I like the, um, what the fuck? Okay, well that line was kind of ruined by the fact it sounded like he was drowning. Cause it was, it, it was like that underwater. It was like, it's like, oh, it's a bigger fish. Oh, stay calm. Yes, sir. Hey, you know what? Monsters? What? Wait, why are we turning around? Can you just like stop talking? Oh, mini kit, mini kit, we need to get it. Um, yeah, uh, I don't know how I, I don't know how I feel about the um, the health bars. I hope it's not like that for human bosses. I hope it's got the the red hearts. Goodbye, because that makes Lego games more special. You know, it's uh, no. Oh, wait, what? Why did it show me a mini kit when I was in the loading base for a cutscene? This is lovely. We must find the queen. Okay. Ah, victory. Oh, oh, Stupid chair. Oh, that's, oh, that's so funny. This, this like an animal. Level status. Oh, did I get a Kyber break? Free play unlocked. All right, cool. Oh, I didn't get the break. How many mini kits? All right, so there's only six mini kits. Reducing. No, there's only five. Move from ten. I think I knew that. Okay, so we now have charged. <laughs> it's really embarrassing. Kyber bricks can be used to upgrade your abilities. The hollow projector. Oh yeah, I forgot about this shit. Speedy sprint. Okay, I can now speedy sprint. 
Nice. How do I do that though? Royal skew. Okay, let's do that. Oh. Because there weren't really any point in that. Health bars look really, like, unnatural. Actually, do you know what? Considering the fact that there's those kind of health bars for all characters, it's probably not going to be hearts for bosses, is there? Which is kind of a shame, because that was one of the... Uh, the sort of unique appeals of... I, I hope, basically, that this is just like an... This is just like an experiment for the LEGO development team. And that this isn't how all their games are going to be forever. Because that would kind of suck, I think. Just all games were like this and never were any different. It's very un-LEGO, essentially, which is probably... Why do they keep making up all these... Why is there... Oh, that's... That's where... That's... Man, uh, Padme, and Padme. But who do we have to thank for our rescue? That doesn't sound anything like her. We're ambassadors for the Supreme Chancellor. And that is my funny man. With the Republic. Do you have transports? In the main hangar, this way. Yours are guys bomb bad. <sighs> what the fuck? I think George Lucas actually made this game. <laughs> what? Hey, getting um, getting combos allows you to um, wait. What? I hit Jado once. Two, three. Let's try this again. One, one, two, three, four. Okay, so everyone dies in four hits. Hearts, maybe. I imagine. I was gonna say this earlier, but the only reason I can imagine that it's more unlego y is to make it more popular to the sort of general public. This seems, which is apart from being like a a, a thing for star, like a thing for Star Wars fans, which is what I said in that earlier in this fucking in the last video. This seems very much like a game that was made to appeal to a wide audience. Can you come on, please? Why well, can't I play as her? Why don't I unlock her as soon as to the transport hangar? But where's that? Oh, I guess it's through here. Oh, I guess it is there. Is there going to be another epic cut? Can I even kill these people? This is her Royal Highness's ship. You ready to go? Absolutely not. Transport to Coruscant. Okay. I don't even know what counts as a level anymore. Is it the bigger fish? Was that... Because I don't remember seeing that stud screen. Was that the entire first... Um... Oh, it's so funny. Look at the funny robots. Oh, it's fucking amazing. That feels like it could have been film audio. It was like. There's not enough power to get us to Coruscant. The hyperdrive is leaking. Coruscant is that what he just said? Hmm. Wait, why did he do that? Jar Jar's already ate himself. Land. The most desperate spaceport seems like. What was even the point of that? There's actually no point of having this screen. Apart from to have this part, which is presumably what always happens. Oh, a load. Yeah, no, but a loading screen. <laughs> wow. This is so, so cool and was definitely worth. This is what cutscenes. Pre rendered cutscenes. That's what they're there for. So you can mask your loading times. Wait! Her Highness commands that I go with you. She's curious about the planet. Horsa, are you, sir? I'm Padme, one of the Queen's handmaidens. That's a kind of good voice for Padme. It makes it seem more, like, legit that she's... Um, how old is she supposed to be in the Phantom Menace? She's 14, right? Um, uh, Mos Espa. Oh, but I'm at Mos Espa. Alright, okay. Stomp on all the people. Can I even kill any of these people? 
Qui Gon's in tower in disguise. My Jar Jar Binks though, R2D2. Oh, I forgot he's in his pack. So I'm gonna dismount. Can I kill any of these people? Oh, nice. Hey! The, hmm, it's actually kind of. Okay, well. The fuck? Okay. Why is she doing that? Yes! Finally, we can do it! We can massacre innocent people! <laughs> like how everyone's screaming, but I don't like how anything's happening. It would be a bit. It would be better if it was like um. Fuck are you. I don't like how they can't die. They're kind of like a marvel. They die all the time. They even sometimes die by accident. Oh, it's both the um both the buttons. Both L1 and R1 to uh to do the thing. Oh, why does there need to be a me? The fuck. I, no, please, no. This is not happening. R2-D2 cannot beat people up. This is so, so stupid. <laughs> <coughs> Holy shit. Fucking fried. Um, me. What's in here? Alright, oh my god. Okay, so R2-D2 put his little robot penis into um, a switch. You know, I just did it because it was there. Because, you know, I've got an astromech droid. So, I don't know what to do with that. I know that I'm... The fuck? You just got to put your robot penis in it sometimes. And just not think about the consequences. And then we've just killed this poor... I don't like you either. What? I thought that was an achievement for killing random... Rodians for no reason. What is this? Can this does this do anything? Yeah, do you know what? I'm just gonna leave now. I I just decided that this is no longer my problem. Oh my god, is it is that is that fucking switch actually a random Rodian is gonna come out and just attack me all the time? If so I regret anything. Also Everyone's quivering in fear. Is it because the Rodians are attacking me? You buying anything? This ain't a museum. You can't just look at stuff and burn. And don't smell anything either. Smells ain't free. And cover your ears. Oh, yeah, I forgot I can't kill him. What a stupid fucking piece of dialogue. Yeah, I'm not going to smell anything, but I'll break all your shit. All right, okay. So we've successfully terrified the entire population of... Um, Tatooine. Where's Jar Jar? <laughs> Jar Jar's got a tongue attack? Oh my god. Alright, so I, I appreciate the the complexity in combat. Complexity in quotation marks, by the way, because I don't believe this is a truly complex system. Wait, I'm trying to get my thing out, but it's just putting it away. Also, the, the, the facial expressions, like I get that it's like, I'm really, really cut. No, no, I fuck this. Oh, it's water. <laughs> okay, this is funner than the game. Will that make everyone shut up and stop panicking? No. I feel like this is a... Um... Oh. What? Why is there all this shit around everywhere? Where am I going? Gather information in Moss Easter about preparing a hyperdrive. Oh, I have to like do shit for people. All right, this is an introduction to how shit the game is gonna be. Let what me guess, looking for ship parts? Thought so, everyone is. You'll be wanting to pay Watto a visit. You'll find a shop across town. But why though? Does Watto have a monopoly on ship parts? And he like a scavenger or some kind of scam man. Yeah, the, the the comical expressions it could look a bit too Lego movie ish 
sometimes, in which I mean that it looks a bit over cartoony. And it's a bit annoying, a little bit. Just a small amount, not a heavily amount, but just a tiny amount of annoying. I can't wait for Lego Lego Marvel 3. Lego, Mar <laughs> Lego Marvel 3. Lego Marvel Super Heroes 3 to be exactly um, like this. I'm surprised that they didn't put in, like, the Clone Wars. Like, they didn't just adapt um, Lego Marvel... No, Lego Star Wars 3, the Clone Wars, and put it into this game. Because people really like the Clone Wars. I'd be surprised if they don't do that at some point. Like, put the Clone Wars into this. Alright, here's Wato. No, I don't speak that language. I need parts for a J-Type 327 Nubian. I have 20,000 Republic Dactaries. The public fairies are no good out here. I need something more real. You're a funny little boy. <laughs> Can't just go up to people and say, you're a funny little boy. I reflexes if you race pods. Why? There's big race tomorrow on Bundy Eve. You can enter my pod. Um, what? Why is she there? The what? force is unusually strong with him. That much is clear. He deserves better what? than a slave's life. The boy tells me you want to sponsor him in the race. Well, I've acquired a pod in a game of chat. No, you didn't. You what? What? It's so fucking stupid. That's what the slaves. Everything needs to happen. Oh, that's by the way, Jar Jar's been around. Not funny. I like his funny Lego tongue. That was so stupid. That's everything we need. What? We make our way to the arena and enter young Anakin what? The race. Where where was the pod? What how so clearly he did not acquire a pod, he was literally building it in front of Watto. And they're talking about the pod that Watto because presumably that one is the one that Watto the, the Anakin crashed, the Anakin mentions in the Phantom Menace. So how How's that even happen? How how <laughs> this is what happens when you try to explain it with like words and shit is like you can you can explain all that through like and show, and show like things like that okay audio options how do I change mumbling mode daddy coach wait Let's know your thoughts on Lego Star Wars Saga on legosurvey.com at Star Wars Saga. So I might do that some other time, but I don't really want to do that right now. Alright, okay, so there's, this could be combined with other studs. Yeah, 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 obviously. Alright, so I see if I get those little things. Pog, companion, because I just, it'll deliver a pacing screen. Yeah, that will be annoying as fuck. A little bird going, ah! Behind you, can we play both characters and ships a whole grab look? Old timey effect to the game. A retro style screen effect. Wow, that's gonna be cool. Places on civilians with gonk droids. Alright, that's kinda funny. Comedy weapons with silly items. With rainbow cantina music from flinging to Arda the Motel Thomas. <laughs> Big head. Pew pew. Okay, so. Alright, okay, so they're all like funny. There's very few like. Like, these are all the good ones, essentially. Was this super gong droid? All right, okay, so yeah, all of the on the studs are the only useful ones. We're gonna play with mumble mode unlocked now. Whereas in like Lego Marvel, there's like st uh, studs come to you. Um, like st attract studs. Uh, you can collect ghost studs. That's a thing that you can do. Um. Okay, he could just be speak. Many people enjoy speaking their own language. Oh. Wait, well, I've got mumble mode on. What are you doing? Many just speaking their own language. Fuck's sake. I want everyone to be speaking my language. My Jedi language. I understand. Alright. Booter Eve classic. Because apparently we got all of... The story has gone trains now. That doesn't make any sense, but it's happening. Alright, let's see how good this is compared to the old one. Because this is a good part of the film, kind of. But it plays a little bit like shit. Alright, let's... This is not mumbling. 
This is a piss take, isn't it? No, this is like a fucking prank when they told people, oh, we're gonna put Mumble in the. Oh god, it's first person. No, I don't want it to be in first person. No, it's awful. Take it back, Gaskin go. What? Tro Troiken, what? Alright, oh, no, so, okay, so, I, I think, uh, Naboo Royal Starship, Naboo Starfighter, Republic Cruiser, Drift for Rush, Vulture Droid, alright, I'm just gonna get rid of this shit. So, go away. So, so when they said, oh, ha ha ha, we're gonna put in a mumble rap mode. That was like a meme, wasn't it? You didn't. They didn't actually. Maybe I was expecting just a bit too much, but I thought when they said, when I heard there was going to be mumble mod, I thought they would like, because that's not mumble mod. People want. You can't just. I guess if you just don't. It's lit. It is. It's. It is in the truest sense of mumble mode. Also, this doesn't feel very hectic. I think there are only five people on the track when there were like 12 people. Also, this kind of controls like not interestingly at all. It's just fine. I have absolutely nothing to say about this. But yeah, it, it is literally, do you want to hear people speak English or language? It, I guess it's not intelligible if it's like Hutties anyways. So it's fake. Combination, it's throwing words together, throwing syllables together to create words, and then throwing those words, fake words together. That's what that is. Is this actually just happening? This is literally boring, boring as shit. It, at least it gets it gets ramped up in the Boonter Eve classic in the original because it's like, oh, look, Sebulba's. Oh wow, that was really tense and epic. Oh look, I'm on a time limit. Oh, I guess I'm behind now. There is literally like those three people and then me. I guess that's how long I'm taking in the race. Okay, so I guess there's times as well. But yeah, um, it it is it is seriously. Do you want people to speak English? Or do you want people to not speak English? It is the laziest thing possible. What people liked about Mumble Mode is that there was physical comedy in replacement of dialogue. So people would go like, huh, huh, and hold something up. Is that supposed to be Sebulba hitting me? Because I can't even tell what's happening. So I'm in first person. And I don't think I can do anything about that. Uh, uh, cr crashing really doesn't feel like is doing anything those pits they don't feel like they're an obstacle nothing feels like an obstacle in this on this race track impressive most impressive we would watch your career with great fucking interest see oh that that is the only thing is when the game decides oh do you know what would be fun on the third lap let's slow him down so that he loses that would be so hilarious. Oh. Is it going to be like... <laughs> Am I going to have to do the entire race? If you've never played the complete saga, by the way, if you lose the race, Anakin just like... Grounds to a halt. Uh, grinds to a halt at the finishing line and goes. <laughs> Smackers on the the dashboard and goes. Bleh. That's all that happens, and then you just get to do the last lap again. But I know. Oh yeah, and I have to do the whole race. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, there's literally five people. 
And I'm pretty sure Suburba might kill one of them during the thing. But this doesn't feel hectic. This kind of feels like shit. Yeah, maybe maybe I'm just not reading. I know I'm getting really caught up on this. And maybe I'm just not getting the consensus. I'm, I'm, not getting, I'm not representing the public feeling of people, why they, people like the old Lego games. But people like Mumble Mode because it, it was non-verbal storytelling. You would tell, you are not, this is not non-verbal storytelling. It is still verbal storytelling. You just don't get to hear the voice acting. You just get to hear that, and it just comes up on screen what it means. You might as well be playing in like Chinese. That is essentially what it is. That doesn't prevent it because it's in another language. It's still vocal storytelling. You just can't understand it, and you need subtitles. What the fuck? Why did they even put that in the game? The sub so pointless. Literally, who who would care about an option like that? I'm gonna hug this side because ow, I need to get I need to get up on the ramp. Oh, oh shit! Yeah, you need to be able to do that pretty fast. That is the only skill required. You need to be able to push X, which is not in fact a skill. That is in fact a non-skill. Anyways, I'm getting really bored of talking right now because I'm just saying the shit. Um, about mumble mode, which is really annoying me. So, I'll see you. I'll just we'll just get to the end of the Boonah Reef Classic. Oh yeah, yeah I've, I've won. Can I? I don't want to hear this cutscene. Just got like this. Oh, oh Jar Jar Binks did actually die. Okay, so when Qui Gon nearly fell out, that was a prelude to the epic slapstick comedy that was coming. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but this man. I don't like you. Why is Darth Maul so like. Others. Oh, look at all the credits. Now you can make all the rims come true anyway. Yippee! <laughs> It's funny, his teddy bear is an alien. <laughs> okay, this might be fun. Okay, the Boon Tree classic. Yeah, I never want to replay that shit ever again. I was so underwhelming. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is kind of fun. You'll get C three PO. Stop leading me to abandoned hearted. What the fuck? That's not three PO. Oh, this is evil. Haunted Hovel. Alright, let's title this episode Getting Haunted by C-3PO in Star Wars The Skywalker Saga. It's a dead conk. <laughs> what is this? Insert. This is gonna be much. I don't think I'm Alright. What? I just, I spent 30,000, <laughs> why? I spent 30,000 studs just to know how to unlock this character. Progress further in either the following, Revenge of the Sith or New Hope. Great, I can't even get Broken 3PO. That's Coruscant, all right. The interior, new territories, the slice, the the, gal the galaxy. Oh, Re Rishi Mays, Arcadists. Arc the fuck it's going oh it's just Jar Jar. That looks really horrifying with this like dark and like trailing sectors, western reaches, greater Javid, unknown regions. So this will be like Coruscant, the other places. New territories will be like the random planets that only exist 
Wow, I like how that was really haunted for no reason. Guess that part of the game is over with. Hey, 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 hey. I don't use that word. Call them force. Oh, we're in the slave quarters. Oh, yeah, I forgot Anakin was a slave. Yeah, that's really funny. Why didn't this game make more slave jokes? That would have been really funny. This is the holograms. Oh, yes. Yeah, forgot the game wanted me to do stuff. Upgrades. Jedi. Um, how do I. I want to switch. Characters. I want to be packed. I want to be part bear. What? No, I don't want to play as Abra Akbar. No, I want to... I just want to play as her for crying out loud. Can I not? Does she not exist in this game anymore? You look bored. Oh, it's H1NT. Wow, it's like hints. Oh, that's so funny. <laughs> yeah, why is Darth Maul? Why is it... Okay, okay, I guess, I guess hip jar just say goober fish. Counts as a... <laughs> Counts as a, um... What is it? Yeah, why is Darth Maul always so... Like, Lego portrays him as so overly expressive nowadays? Okay, this is just really annoying. I'm gonna switch back at the earliest possible. How to do it. Well, it's funny, he has a hard time switching it off. Yeah, everyone. Oh, yeah, I can hyperdrive that, can't I? Wait, first of all, I just wanna get. Fuck off. I wanna get rid of the stupid. Oh, I guess I have to do this. Alright, let's hyper travel. Travel to Croissant, to the Federal District. <laughs> this could be a mini game in and of itself. You could like fly around. Oh, it's just a loading screen. Yeah, the, Lego always portrays Darth Maul as so like so expressive. Like he's always like neutral. He's completely flat, and that that's kind of what makes him cooler. He like smiles once. I... <laughs> it sounds like Minecraft villager. <laughs> Obi Wan's leaving. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the only comedy I'll continue to get out of this is by doing impressions of it. Go like, <laughs> Some actually, I think that games like this could take from older um, Lego games is that, uh, specifically Lego Marvel Super Heroes, is that they need to have good post games, but almost no uh, Lego game has good post games anymore. Like, a lot of them just, like, don't at all. Like, if you really think about it, Lego games and, like, Pokemon games. You know, I know we talk about Pokemon a lot on this channel, but they're kind of, like, the same beast in that um, popular big sort of games. Big story. You know, Lego games are all about the story. Pokemon games, they're kind of all about, like, the main plot uh, bit. But then... Post game, <laughs> most of, most of them no post game or like very little post game. The only really thing that there is to do afterwards, where all Jedi can hero grapple hooks. Oh, there's not even certain characters with different things. No, it's shit. Don't use mumble mode. I probably name one of these videos using getting annoyed at mumble mode and getting annoyed mumbling angry things under my breath in. Um, in Lego Star Wars The Complete Saga. It's really, if there is any, it's like, collect all of the things. That's that's usually what they are. Okay, so what, what have we got? We've got side quests, puzzles, trials, and challenges. That's like, so that is essentially, collect everything, because you're trying to get to 100%. After the story, there's really only get to 100%. Wow, this is so cool. I like how there is literally zero... Um, excitement now because I know every single planet. Let's go through all of them. Yeah, post games. The only really thing that you can do is like collect the collect everything in like both games, unless there is a post game story. Now, for a lot of 
uh, Pokemon games, they take the initiative and they put in a, a story after the, the, the story. I think the Delta episode is the main modern example for Pokemon. But, uh, you know, there's been... I'm just going to listen to this cutscene because no one fucking cares. To the Senate. Yes. So, but Delta episode is probably the best thing. Uh, in modern memory because it is a great gift to see you alive your majesty with the communications breakdown we had begun fearing the worst you won't know there's a communications breakdown literally this is not a game to to see if you don't know star wars i'm anxious to hear I'm anxious about this to hear about the double key. nobody fucking cares about me because I'm just a baby boy. The Chancellor Valorum has called for a special session with the Senate to discuss the situation. This is fun. Well, we can do this. 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 Yeah, this little real power, and it is unlikely the Senate will act on the invasion. Why? It's illegal. They didn't decide to make it legal. I know they say it's legal. But it's not. I'm literally walking. Sorry! This is so fun, literally walking around listening to a man talk. Supreme Chancellor, who can take control and give us justice. This is so epic and amazing that I just want to stop playing and go play Just Cause 3. Or go read a book. Or kill myself. I don't know. I... She's furry alien. Why can't we pick people? <laughs> the Jedi have gone crazy. They're killing everybody. They're killing the Naboo. They're killing the Naboo people. Come on, what? What, because you died? You got murdered. Can't do anything about all that. Can't judge yourself. You should be able to pick people up. Come on. What kind of game allows you to pick shit up and doesn't let you pick them up? Here we are. These transport ships will take us to the Senate building. I have some prior business to attend to, so I shall go on ahead. Once you're ready, come find me in my office. We shall proceed to the meeting. Until then. Okay. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Just sprints over. All right, that means we can go do stupid shit. We can now officially uh, free roam and do some stupid shit. Yeah. Um, but really, the only big, like... I guess with like side stories or like things like that for Lego games, it works best when it's like an original um, story. So one of the big ones I can think of that is a post game it are the, again, because this is a really good Lego game. I think Lego Marvel Super Heroes is a pretty good game and I would definitely recommend it um, over... Lego Avengers. The problem is Lego, and like uh, I think over Lego Marvel Super Heroes two, two because the story just isn't. It's not as solid, and it's a bit into like the the Marvel cosmic. You'll probably understand every, if not most, characters from uh, Marvel one. But but there's uh, after the main story, you can do Deadpool missions. The the Blue Ghost. Of Agent Coulson that you've been following around shouldn't don't they need something to live these people because that's like Cad Bane right don't they need like oxygen tanks to live isn't that why he's got the oh no these are just pointing to all the taxis oh so I wow this was a really good <laughs> really good mission marker cross planet senate building yes please <laughs> Fuck all of you. I'll be... <laughs> Wait, did I just pilot that? That's not how taxis work. <laughs> what? You can't do that. It's like, oh yeah, pay for this taxi. You're essentially renting a car. You're not even renting a car. You're using a car for five minutes to get to a place. 
Except it's not a car, it's a spaceship. I'm probably going to end recording before I get into the Senate, but I'm just going to end my thought. Yeah, the Deadpool red bricks. The Deadpool, so Deadpool replaces the ghost of um, Coulson, and he allows you to um, kick with the dress, with her dress that has an extension cord cable, that once you see it, you'll never unsee it ever again for as long as you live. Ah, oh, alright, so we're destroying these lights. Oh, <laughs> you can throw his wrench at people, that's kind of cool. So, Deadpool basically appears everywhere, and you can, it, it incentivizes you to get gold bricks. Gold bricks, which can be done through side quests, um, just like challenges for gold bricks out in the overworld, um, like helping, helping people, um, doing shit out in the overworld or doing stuff in levels so getting true believer which is that game's true jedi um it's got the little but <laughs> you turn to the dark side that was a really good mission so you get you get deadpool missions and it incentivizes you to get red bricks and get gold bricks in order to play them so you can get red bricks so you can get cheats hello there i am the wandering wookie why does Obi-Wan understand Wookiee speech? He ain't a protocol droid. My passion for exploring takes me over. Be sure to keep it off for me. Cross out it's made up of many, many layers. It's like a big onion. Just so funny. Don't they? I was gonna say, isn't that a joke from Hercules? Yeah, anyways. Okay, this episode's kind of dumb. In future, I will probably kill less people for, without reason. Uh, I, no, I absolutely will not kill more people will be killed for even less reason uh, and we'll find the Senate and then it, maybe I'll stop stop playing Phantom the prequels and go on to the original series time to kill me. time for Obi-Wan to die so I don't have to be in this shit movie anymore <laughs> I died four times what the hell <laughs> Hello everybody, welcome to more fucking Star Wars. I discovered something while I was trying to play it, so I'm just going to show it to you now. I'm going to have to turn this down though, so that it definitely doesn't pick up any of the intro. On my mic, on my mic recording. Alright, so we're getting back into episode 1. We're going to hopefully finish it this recording. See, I don't think it said this the last time, but we got we got Star Wars, but it might have... Uh, I'll go check. I'll go back and check the recording if I remember to do that. And go see if it said that. But look, episode 1. F F Tom Manas Manasse story so far. All right, so it does actually tell you on the road again after being forced to land on the planet of Tatooine to repair their ship. Qui Gon came across a young boy called Anakin Skywalker. His intuition about the charts served him well as he discovered that Anakin was unusually strong with the Force. Unable to cover the ship repairs with regular credits, Qui Gon had no option but to gamble on the young boy's skills as a pod racer, entering him into the deadly Boon to Eve Classic, with hopes of winning the ship parts you need. Thankfully, our connection to the Force helped him victory. Now the ship ready for quite Coruscant Jedi training. Whoa! So I don't think it said that. No, wait, what? Oh, I'm going to the Senate. We'll go to the Senate. 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 You know, I finished watching episode one yesterday, and I I have to say, it's not so bad as everybody says. It's really not. It's kind of it's it's, it's better than episode two. I'll tell you that for free. Why? Seriously, is there ever a mod? If you finish this game, put in the comments. But can you pick up people ever? Because that seems like it would be a really good feature. I think it would be a bit big, 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 big missed opportunity if they they just don't let you. Why does Qui Gon Jinn look so fucking angry all the time with his lightsaber? And it probably looks bored. She smiled. She. Is she happy when she run? She looks just sad in the film. What does Anakin? Oh, he look, he look, he look like he got a beard. The fuck? He kind of looked like he got a beard, and not really part of his chin. What does Anakin look like? Anakin, he looks smile, even though he also looks like. <laughs> that was a mighty throw. All right, let's stop wasting time. Let's go into the light. Are you ready to begin? That's this is the Chancellor's office. What? This is not what they, that building looks like in the, the film. It's kind of small. Yes, I'm child. Oh, oh my God! Why does Palpatine looks like he's? 
shielding. I'm moving my hands and you can't even tell. He's shielding rage. We must do something quickly to stop the Federation. That's not what she sounds like. Honorable representatives of the Republic. She sounds just as bored though. No confidence in Chancellor Valorum's leadership. Why? Why would he do that? Why would she do that? Go back to Naboo. Oh, okay. Please, your Majesty, stay here where it's safe. Oh God, the frame rate. Is my Padawan learner. Now is not the time for this. Go with the Queen to Naboo and unravel the mystery of the Sith. Clouded, this boy's oh. future is. All right, the voice for Yoda. I guess I just get. I guess they just get that one guy to do it for like all Lego things, and they've had him for like ten years. He's a pretty good Lego voice. That literally tell. That literally tells you nothing. So I don't, don't want to do that. You can convince false mass to help us. You have to. Why? Why do we have Jar Jar Binks? Yay! Uh, yeah. Let's just go back to. Wait, do we have to go all the way? So we have to take a taxi back to the ship platform, back to the fucking other place. Alright. Is he actually gonna, like, talk every time he comes there to me? I like the sliding transition, but I, I would like it less if it just, like, stopped. If it didn't just stop, because that kind of breaks my emotion. Is that my ship? I think that's my ship. What up here? Oh! Why I haven't seen one of these since I was a boy. <laughs> where, where he got? What? I can't go. There he is. <laughs> Dude, what? <laughs> he just disappeared and then he reappeared again. He look all cool. Can I make this droid disappear? Use. Oh, this is where we can starship. Which ones do we have? Royal Naboo, Naboo Starfighter, Public Club. Hey! Wait, is that broken the game? Can I actually just fly a Republic cruiser for the rest of the. Hey! Wow! That's nice. Is it actually. Oh, that wasn't supposed to happen. Okay, that was that. That's the, that's the perils of ba balancing my fucking thing on an empty box of Lego. So I guess it's the thematic, but eventually it's gonna fall over, and there ain't nothing I can do about that. So let's just stop. I don't kick either of my legs, real hard. But yeah, I was gonna do this epic funny thing where I complain about, or just like generally made fun of like these like two. I think there's three videos by two people like sort of complaining about these about the game because a lot of the complaints and I, I, I feel like the complaints i'm trying to raise in this series but what but what like powanga pa, pa, padme battle of naboo but it's not a battle yet collect studs what no you can't you can't do you can't collect studs can't can't do that. Am I? Is this the right thing? Is this the right place? Oh yeah. But wait. Oh no. The place has been deserted. I pray that Boss Nass is still here. Let's visit his throne. <laughs> oh yes, that makes so much fucking sense. Who's unlocked the big bubble? Don't Nisa know how moy of a head pain it is to open? All the switches and all the walking. Just thinking about it. <laughs> that was some real good dialogue, so everybody left. Except this one guy. What the fuck? I think I just glitched on a thing. He this guy, he apparently didn't get the memo. And he's just trying to get back in. The big bubble. For some reason he needs to get inside the big bubble. Yeah, that really. Really? Why are they Why are they blue? What? Oh, does that show that I can ride them? Probably does. 
Why would he be here? Why? Of all the plot There's to nobody here either. Have they been captured? Perhaps they have. Or maybe they fled. Of course, sir. Who can hide them? When in trouble, go to second place. How can he not find them there? Follows me. Oh my god, headshots do actually something. Oh my god. Or oh, maybe it's just Pabe is too fucking cold. Also, it kind of ruins the thing because it's this Queen Amidala, but it's Pabe, so it kind of, kind of, there's no, it's just like an on, on twist. It's not even like, but yeah, of, of all the plot to brush over, like why? It's just like really. Oh, is that Jar Jar Bing? So it's like already really. Yeah, I don't even want to talk about that Gunga situation. Oh, there he is. Wait, what? See the guide, but where's our Jar Jar? Is Jar Jar an imposter? <laughs> Why isn't there just a swimming loading screen? That would be cool! Why can't everything just be a loading screen? <laughs> just a game. Where is the game where it's just a whole loading screen? Feel free to make a joke about that as you will. But yeah, the plot is already so fucking weak. Here. See, they already they have the handmaiden, and I know she has other other handmaiden. They go to the effort of making it. <laughs> they, go <to> the <laughs> they go to the effort of making. Oh, the, okay. The that guy's brave. He doesn't even. <laughs> it should get real when you part a lightsaber. How many times have I actually had to build? What have I actually done in this game so far? Maybe it's just because it's been ages, but I don't really feel like I've done loads. Talk about using your head. Why do I need to grab it? You didn't need to grab it in any of the old games. You should fucking... Jar Jar Binks, Misano. Like this game up. This fucking... Who said this? I am Queen Amadala. No, I am Queen Amidala. Oh, no, this I is... am Queen Amidala. No, I am Queen Amidala. Oh, this is so... Amidala. I am Queen Amidala. I'm sorry for my deception, but it was necessary to protect myself. Why does she s we do not sound like... Quickly, all will be lost forever. I beg you to help us. Maybe... We saw being friends. <laughs> you kill. You saw killer the frog. I me saw like that. Launch an attack on their control ship and confront the vice war. I think this game designer has got confused about who the voices is. Is because the Gongans will do their part. But if the vice war escapes, he will return with another droid army, Your Highness. That is why we must head to feed immediately. And retake the palace. What's my part? I want to help. You help by Shot. hiding somewhere safe and staying alive. Doesn't sound like helping. Well, you'll help later on by fucking living. So don't worry. Oh my god, get me out of this place. Yeah, if, 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 if they got their voices confused because she sounds more like the other person than the the Padme. I, I don't think they ever give her decoy like a name in the film. Oh shit. Take a speeder and retake the palace. Yeah, but where the speeder? It's speeder. Oh shit, I'm not doing that. Where the where is it? Oh it's over here. Oh the leader, lead the leader. Yeah, so the voices got confused. Pabe's voice is so good anymore because they they made her try to do the the more serious <laughs> They made her to try to do the ser more serious like deep Break the game, break the game, break the game, please let me break the game. They made like Padme try to do like the more serious uh, decon, decon, what? Decon? Decoy voice. But she doesn't sound like that. She's more, she's more normal. Also, they didn't make the clear the fact that there's maybe these people didn't even fucking watch the Phantom Menace, so just don't care. Because there is a difference. There is a difference. It's always when I'm saying something as well, I find find it just now because I've never tried to do this stupid ass method before 
Kill the fucking wildlife. It got away. No. It... I don't want. I don't want to allow it. I'm crying. Okay, it's now become invincible. Better call them all. Cause whoever made these titles just fucking stop. Maul is not a funny character. Darth Maul does not have a lot of comedic potential. What? Guys, I think the game's broken. Pressing some of the buttons make sounds happen. Right, I'm just gonna like, I'm just gonna restart because I really don't think it's wanting to work. But I feel, I feel like the completes that I've made in so far have been like pretty, pretty justified, pretty reasonable um, critiques, criticisms. Uh, probably my biggest one, but this is just like completely subjective. It's like barely even a criticism is that I just don't think it's funny. Um, but then again, I am above the age demographic for the game, so I, I, I can't I can't really expect like really good. They took out they took out some funny lives when like when Obi Wan they included that part in where and where Obi Wan says to Qui Gon, "Oh, we've picked up another." fucking pathetic life for me. He looks directly at Anakin and then kicks him in his little, little boy shins. They took that part out from the film and I thought that was really funny. I thought it was kind of weird and like out of place, like direct like child abuse. But it was kind of funny. Alright, hopefully I don't have to do all that shit again. Alright, well I'll just get through this. I feel I'll wait, wait to take the fucking game out of the game. Alright, well. Um, but yeah, the criticisms are very stupid, but I can't remember the criticisms because in those in those two videos, because uh, it's been so long. I do remember this the one other guy. There was like one person who I thought was way more fucking stupid than the other, and his complaints were a lot stupid in the year. Uh, so, but I'll make fun of them in another uh, in a later date. But, Maybe it's because I killed the bird, so I won't do that this time. Maybe that bird is cursed. I wouldn't. I won't be surprised, honestly, if that bird was cursed. Oh, towering in the tree line. Hey, it's kind of like Mario Odyssey, except like how it, however you get a mood, it goes like and it like holds up, and it says like a a little subtitle. Except it's a lot. Hey. You're working now, except it's just a lot less fun than Mario Odyssey so, so far. The way you collect shit, yay, working! All right, so this is called what? Well, Better Call Mall, yeah. So I, why'd you call him Annie? Annie. Annie. Get to your ship. <laughs> My guess is the Viceroy is in the throne room. My guess? What? But, but that's my shit! Oh, that's so fucking epic and cool. Where was? Ha, oh, it's. Ha. Oh. We'll handle this. We'll take the long way. We'll take the long way. He takes his cloak off. They've all taken their cloaks off suddenly. They don't have capes anymore. Let Darth Maul take. Oh, he took his cape off. Okay, nice. <laughs> he didn't look angry. Well, he kind of did at the, during the fight, but it was because he was stressing. Darth Maul. All right, let's see how they handled human fights. Be on guard and remember your training, Obi Wan. Oh, I'm kind of locked on like a route. Oh wait. Hold. Wow, I really like how Darth Maul. <laughs> Darth Maul's boss fight is a tutorial. I, I, I didn't want to learn this all beforehand. Because then that might have been fun. Okay, there is. There is things to combat. That's something that I definitely don't think he could say about the game, because 
Um, one of the one of the video child's game. Um, this game, like the combat, has no complexity, and it's like, well, I guess if you take it as um, as its own entity, like maybe compared to I don't know, what's a really combat-heavy game? Fucking like the like a com combatly complex game. Like it, it, yeah, you'd say maybe it was no fighting game. Maybe maybe you would say that if you were a fucking idiot. <laughs> He's fleeing. So he kind of does have three. Oh my! Yeah, it's Obi Wan. I could. See. Oh my God! All right, okay, I do like this. Just times where there's just a fuck ton of like battle droids. That is, that is cool. That's what, because you know this game is more powerful. I think I mentioned that. Oh, health hearts. Hey, I still like that. I don't really like how they're made out of Lego. They're the only things I would prefer not be Lego and be like how they were in the old games. I've not ever, I think they've. I think the Lego Movie video game. That's the only time they were like that. It, now that game's charm is sort of devalued, but it's not like anyone. Fucking, do you care about the Lego Movie video game? I don't care. He's just running away from me. This is just an enemy gauntlet. But yeah. Oh yeah. I um. I just how did how did I just don't like Lego um, destroyer droids. They look pretty weak and like kind of puny. Alright, the droid thinking people. Right, so we better get rid of him. We can't have him. We can't have the droids. He was gonna die anyways. Don't worry. Why did he look scared? It's like really cumbersome to pick something up, but like, yeah, it's it's so it's, 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 it's the fighting game. Yeah, there's there's dodge, there's a dodge, there's a pick stuff up, there's a lightsaber throw. There's not a lot of moot. Oh, he was just frozen there because the cutscene needed to happen. Oh. Oh. Why would he do that? That's so ridiculous. Darth Maul would never do that, he's too cool. This is kind of, like, not interesting. <laughs> I know that kind of conflicts with the point that I'm tr trying to make where, like... All I'm trying to say is that it's... Maybe it's not the most complex video game ever. Like, fighting combat-wise. It's pretty, it's pretty run-of-the-mill, but it's like... For LEGO games, if you think about... Come on. It's a big step up from, especially, the the older Star Wars like the well, just just a lot of them, because a lot of Lego games. I know I talk about Lego Marvel a lot. I've been mentioning that quite a bit in this series, but that has uh, one attack and two attack. That has just... oh. Hey, no, I just remember. This is kind of what he does. He kind of run. Like the leap, my eyes couldn't manage it. Let's find another way to reach it. <laughs> Why did he say that? What? <laughs> what? Why is that bad dialogue that they put into this game? Why flies could manage it so I'm too fucking old. Wait, uh, why, why does it work? Oh, yay. Alright. Oh, uh, shit, the snipers? Droid snipers? Yeah. Oh, no, but I do remember one of the criticisms, and this is like, i would probably bring this up in future, but it, he said like... Basically, like, the second guy, I don't even think this person knows. He said he loved Star Wars and Lego. But I think that was in, like, isolation. Like, Star Wars and then, like, Lego as in, like, the building stuff. I don't think this guy's really ever played another Lego game, like, in his entire fucking life. Like, he, this guy had no idea what the fuck you were on about. Why does he only have one heart now? I didn't defeat his second heart. There's no objects to throw. Oh, 
Oh, so you can block to make this happen. All right. Just keeps running. Like there's, there's seemingly no reason to it. Like I get, I get it in most Lego boss fights because it's like, oh, you take out a heart and then they disappear. They <laughs> just give up. No, I did. Can't do that. <laughs> what is the reason? Just stop talking. Oh, okay, I get it. Okay, no, I don't get it. Did I let this blue one out then? Alright! I thought that one would be sealed off too, so I would have to put like a... Like a fake one in. <laughs> Raise your lightsaber. Oh shit. It's fucking force choking me, bro. <laughs> you immediately fucked up Obi-Wan. Like, cause it... It didn't even show, like, all the times that I think I had, like, hit him enough to deplete his health bar, it didn't even, like, show it. Darth Maul should never be described as being worn down. That makes him seem so less fucking cooler. Forces with him also. Yeah, if it, if it actually... I like that you can fight in this area. I think that I think that's cool that you've sort of got like a wider arena. I think yeah, this is cool. I think. What? <laughs> oh my God. Promise. Promise me you will train the boy. <laughs> yes, Master. Really? Oh, he ain't coming back. Okay, that was kind of funny. Your little insurrection is at an end, Your Highness. Your occupation here has been after This one's a decoy. What? That's not funny. Now, by <clears throat> time, we'll discuss a new treaty. Okay, alright, this has got to be the last level. <laughs> this has got to be over soon. Do something, R2. <laughs> <laughs> I just push it. Why couldn't he get his own shit? No, stop fucking talking. It's not funny. What? Oh my. Welcome to Warriors. We shall ready to do Asapa. That man just died. Wait, what? Which one are we gonna play? We can play Battle of Gunga. A space army. <laughs> General Judge, we shall must be making our way to the battlefield. <laughs> Why? Why is that boss fight not the last one? Completing ma complete mauling. Okay. Do you, do you ever feel like the Goggins were just a mistake? I just, I just like feel like my brain is rotting whenever I, whenever I think about the Gunga. Whenever I consider the Gunga, I always think, no, why did it have to be this way, George? It didn't have to be like this. But that still worked. But I just got no studs. Okay then. It's a good, good design. I got the fucking Famber out of the way, bro. I gave him the moon, moon shoes. Why did I just say that? No, I didn't. Why are they just some... Can't keep them. They're like... 
explosives. Load the work on. Great. I did it. I'm so glad that we got to play that, everybody. But this is like enhancing like the gaming experience of this like thing. Okay, maybe. I don't think it included any of that. Yeah, no, it's broken as shit. I don't know how much of this. To be fair, I don't think any of that footage is going out bad, but no, I'm going good. If you saw any of that side quest, I just want to say it was boring as shit, but yeah. Uh, I'll, I won't talk, this guy, this guy, I won't, I'll talk about the criticisms later. So we have two more levels. Yeah. Gungan. And then space battle. The guy cut the grass. Why is he doing that? All in a booring camps. That's not canonical. You're so scary. You're so scary. You say that's got. Got the Okay. Oh, Freddy Frog. Mount what? <laughs> okay, this could actually be fun because I think this is the first time we've ever got a Lego depiction of the Battle of Nambu. Love the Gunga Cabals. Oh, I was meant to do more than one. The battle probably won't start without me, so I'll just get to that. Get to that now, but yeah, this guy was like, "Oh, why can't uh, I'm? Why why can't we?" He essentially, he complained that this game wasn't a sandbox. He was like, "Why did Minecraft start the, the trend of being able to build things wherever you want when when Lego? I build stuff with Lego all the time, right? Why? What is his voice? He's like, I. Why isn't he shoot? Why aren't they shooting me? I build stuff with Legos all the time." Why can't you build stuff in this Lego video guy? I'm gonna play as Captain Tarples. He's the unsung hero of the of the South. Defeat the Thumber Shields. Defend the Thumber Shields. Or, oh, so is there like actually a thing? Can I like actually lose? That would be fun. See, here's how you critique video games, everybody. You don't just say, "Oh, this game." I can't just I can't play fucking Street Fighter Two and say, oh, "Why, why did this have a?" an open world because it was never advertised as having an open world and it also came out in like 1992 or whatever Street Fighter 2 came out you can't you can't just say it hyperbolic oh funny battle funny robots <laughs> oh my god oh I forgot there was a mini map that shows me where all the evil people men are if this okay this is how you this is how you make critiques, and this isn't even really a critique, this is more of a... <laughs> <coughs> oh god, everything's going wrong. <laughs> make even bigger. We can make the catapult better and bigger. See, say, say why can you only do that and not like... <laughs> Captain Tarples is excited. It's like, why can't... Uh, oh, my God. Uh, wait, this has only just happened now. You spin and move around. It's actually really... Oh, fuck. It's actually really boring. It might just be the mood I'm in. That looks pretty cool, but yeah, this is how to do a critique. And this is... Oh, <laughs> yeah, there ain't no way I'm killing all of that. But I'm... Oh, yeah, it's now like a... Launch Boomer. I always wanted to launch the Boomer. Alright, I need to take out these tanks first. If this was more like a, a prob- Is it actually going to shot charge our big stupid fucking face? Wow, that was some pretty crazy stuff. Alright, we're going to finish it now. The last two bits, I think. I think we've got two bits anyway, so I've got to turn it down so I don't pick up the copyrighted music. Let's see. I think we can continue from the the Gunga army. Hopefully, story so far. Disheartened by the Senate's lack of action. All right. Okay. 
turn to Nabu and persuaded the Gungans to help fight the droid invasion. Nice, however, the Trade Federation weren't the only army enemy of foot in the past mysterious pointy. Mysterious pointy Sith Darth Maul confronted the Jedi. Right, Qui-Gon was struck down, alright, so we know that he died. Continue on constraining, Gungan army. Lots of mechanics, that means droids. Yeah, you need to be explained to that. Maybe it was better if I didn't look at this. Okay, so we just get we're getting started from this part. Um, and I just I just would like to say because I really I really don't want to continue talking about the the criticisms thing. I really don't have anything to say. More more to say about. It. I'm just gonna pause it. It's just so I could get outmanned, but not outgunned. Okay, that's pretty funny. Um, it's kind of a good meme, I guess. But yeah. Uh, also, uh, I haven't said it yet, but I would I do like the um the covered uh, hood on Palpatine. That should be a real piece in real life. That that represents a definite a definitely clear graphical improvement over the complete saga, wherein like the alien heads that weren't real all look that weren't like Lego pieces all look like absolutely terrible. They all look like um they're from like they're real Lego. Uh, I do wish there was a different one of these screens for each game. So, like, this doesn't really uh, make sense because it's, like, episode... You, well, you can see. I don't even need to tell you. So, the the criticism that I was trying to say from that guy was basically that... Because I have no idea how much got put in because my computer decided to just not work at all last time. It's harder than it looks. Not really. You just got to get the tanks. They're the main thing. So with this this whole thing, and like like with the pre the previous thing with the shield, I I just wished like okay, the the critique that is it's like a non critique is essentially like a lot of the it's either with the the criticism of this game the criticisms of this game in videos where it's like this game is so this game this game is sucks this game is sucks don't buy it. It's just same words that don't mean anything. Just doing that. Alright, we've killed all the battle droids. Really? Where? This Oh we oh is it are we dead? Oh. Oh! I like the. I like that. No, that's good. That's that's good physical comedy. <laughs> Is he gonna throw that? Yeah. I think I like the voice of you. I can. Outmanned but not outgunned. Yeah. So with with that whole Gungan section, I guess that would be like a. So it's like a non-criticism say. Why can't you build things in this Lego game? Because the game, you, you, why would you expect that? If you would played other Lego games, you would you would also not you would not expect that because that is only in Rick. Oh oh god, Mamma me! I'm being fucking what? I'm being murdered. Oh, join the battle. Okay, well that's what I'm doing now. Throw it on top of it, or so it's like a non-criticism. You would never expect it. it's only been in Lego Worlds, and even then, I think that is like restricted building that you can't. I don't think you can just build anything anywhere. Uh, I have no idea though because I've never played. Uh, I've never played Lego. Uh, what is it called? Lego Worlds. Yeah, I've never played that one. Um, but I think uh, when you're saying things like that, that w that is not a criticism. I don't think you would word that like this is critique gaming critique 101. You you don't mention things like that that like are completely hyperbolic as critiques. That would be like a suggestion for future games. So you don't say, oh, this game is bad because it doesn't have. So like the, the whole Gungan section, I I wouldn't say, oh, that gate that wasn't like a tower defense section. Because that would that would be a suggestion. That's what I think would have been better if it was like 
you had time to prepare and it was like onslaught like it was like more of like a game instead of just like or two rounds and then you lose anyways that's my suggestion that is not a criticism uh that it wasn't like that it's a criticism that it wasn't more better uh, and that it was kind of dull and boringy not funny this really oh can i kill my allies that would be really funny if you could like kill your allies and they like like screamed when they died that would actually be like a really good game now this is pod racing oh that's the level i feel like george george lucas i was about to say george L. lucas george lucas must have this is tense george lucas must have hated this child he's like oh this kid's that's what I'm going to do. It sounds like a nine-year-old. Well, that's the guy. Was he even in that scene? That's more fun. It's not. Huh. Either that or two. I guess we have to do everything. I know I'm nine years old, but... There's no mentioning of, like, the shield, which is, like, the whole plot of that part. Oh. <laughs> Come on, R2. Let's do everything by a... Oh, well, thanks, game, for putting me right under the shit where I can immediately die. That's really cool. Um, I like that you have to focus properly in order to fire a proton torpedo at some of that. That seems pretty good. I need to just... I need to get my angles right, because I'm not in this... Oh, my God, I'm upside down. This, this is the bad thing, because it's just constantly people talking. Doing a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Ha! I'd like to see some Boba do this. That does feel like something Anakin would say, and that's not even sarcasm. If everything could just like calm down and like shut up for a second, that would be fun. Like, if he didn't say that, that would be more fine. What's the point of having a proton torpedo if like bullets work just fine like I'm not gonna lie, it was like kind of the point of the first film that he didn't really know what he was the film that he didn't really know what he was doing. He's just a boy, he didn't know anything. Alright, so just <laughs> So just shoot everything. There's not even like there's not even like tension. Like oh, wait, you've got to wait a bit for your shields to go up, and then you can press the shields. That would be that would be fun, you know. It, uh, simple things. I think you've earned some pin. And now this is pod racing. They got some kind of Jedi. I love water. Of course it's one of yours because you literally asked them to do that. Okay, I'm pretty sure this is the end of episode one. And that took me 14 minutes. Control ship has been destroyed. Look. They are broken. <laughs> well observed. How do, how do they know about the control ship? Are they gonna ball? That would be cool to have done that during gameplay. To like throw the what they call them boomers. Throw them. See, there's missed opportunity. On your election, Chancellor. Together, we <laughs> shall bring peace and prosperity <laughs> to the Republic. <laughs> oh, okay, that was kind of funny. The Council have granted Aww. me permission to train you. Yippee! There's no doubt <laughs> the mysterious warrior was a Sith. What? No. Oh. Always two. There are. A master and an apprentice. Was pointing at Jar Jar because he's the Sith Lord. <laughs> what? They chose to have dial. What? They chose to include dialogue, but they didn't have him. They could. He did. He just went. Ah. Well, yeah, you know, you just. You know, you just saw. Uh, they didn't have him go peace like he does in the actual film. Why? Why didn't they let him do that? Peace. 
True Jedi. All right, Prodigy. Sick. Four out of six Kyber bricks. All right, cool. Oh, mini kit. Okay, so that's the build of Naboo. General Grievous. All right. Well, what's what's gonna happen now? Let's see. Uh, will I just get dropped into the open world, maybe, or will I? Will it just put me into episode two? Free play. Okay, you've completed my first episode. Congratulations. Select this episode again to revisit levels in free play mode. Play as any character you've unlocked. Discover new mini kits, but that's not all. Oh! Alright, use this mode to explore the galaxy areas. Ah! I like that. Okay, so. You. Okay, so speaking of that, alright, Attack of the Clones now. Uh, remember, you can change the episode of Galaxy Free Play any time from the whole project. Now continue your saga. Alright, thank you. Hey, no, that was a kind of. That was a neat trick. I really like that. They, I feel like there should have been more levels. Like, I get that it's a big. Oh, there's missing time. Alright, my computer just doesn't want to be at work today. That's fine. Um, I like how there's percentages on each to tell you. No, I don't. You can read that. I don't really care about the percent percentages on each, but I guess it makes it easy to digest whether you've got 100% or not. But yeah, five level. I, I just don't feel like it's enough of the film that you actually play. I get it. I get it why there's less because it's levels are being substituted for open world sections, which is what a lot of, like, a particular before Better Call Mall, which is an awful name. Um, this is really the thing where it's, like, you also try to have, like, kind of funny, like, I, I, I like all of the, like, the Boon Reef Classic, that's what it is, a bigger fish, understand, outman, but not outgunganned. That could have been a better section. I just don't feel like there's been enough, like, gameplay here. Like, I think this has been, like, just over an hour of, like, actual... Uh, like like episode gameplay, so stuff that has been like not the most boring thing you've ever seen ever. But when we get to Attack of the Clones, there's a lot of stuff. I think particularly with these two, most of the prequel memes come from here. I'm surprised there wasn't like the the warping. The only like prequel meme, and it, I feel disgusted to even be like prequel memes. But um, there's like the warped Palpatine one. I've seen that, and then the. Uh, an unfortunate surprise, but cool. Whatever Palpatine says when he's gonna get elected chancellor. Also, you have no idea Palpatine's getting getting elected chancellor. So it's just like, cause what is it? One of the guys in the video, like the, the main video, and I might make fun of him later on, but I'm not. I'm not gonna do a full episode where I just like run through them because I actually can't be bothered. Um, but he was like. Oh, as, as a star, he literally said Star Wars veteran. Those words came out of his mouth. Um, I, I don't know. I always fucking do this thing where I where I talk for a million years at the end of an episode. But just indulge me this time. I'm trying to do it less often. He said, like, uh, as a Star Wars veteran, I already understand the entire plot. He used that as like a criticism. Like this game wasn't like the entire plot. Like that's the whole, whole point that you're going through all the videos. <laughs> The thing is, this Star Wars Lego games, they're, they're not made for people who know this story inside out like it's the back of their face. Oh, there's more things to see as you go around. Hey, I like that. Um, no, these games are for little Timmy who wants to... Who is going to be like, what, you, what? You're telling me that I can... That this, is, this is what the game is made for. It's for little Timmy. Or little... Timetha. Timetha who they 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 they're like they they want to be like whoa you mean you're trying to tell me that I can play in the stories of these films that I like but also it's lego and it's like cartoony and fun wow that's amazing that's what the game is for but anyways that's getting off the point and now I can't remember what the point was oh yeah he said that he would not recommend it if you've like seen star wars but I would I would counter that point by maybe maybe it's you 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 God if you if you're in between the states of you know everything about Star Wars and you're unwilling to even see it to to the end. Uh, I'm gonna see if I'm just trying to see if there's anyone I can buy. Gun Gun Warrior, yes. Wait, how much money do I have? All right, I have two thousand studs, so I want to be careful. I want to see how much Darth Maul is. Yep. The time has come for me to return. 
like that. This is one of the big things, like the character interactions. So, but I don't, I don't think Darth Maul's going to have anything particularly interesting with um with small child Anakin Skywalker. All right, so this looks like a side quest. This is terrible. What kind of unstupidous wretch would steal an air taxi? Oh yes, probably. How are the good people of Coruscant supposed to get around now? Use one of the other taxis. Oh yeah, well, yeah, maybe. Yes. Huh. I suppose that is an option. But that doesn't excuse stealing. Please, you have to help me find my missing taxi. I like this stupid voices oh, because that's... Great planet. The taxi was here before I went on my break. Yeah. Local residents. Alright, taxi unfair. It's kind of a cool name. Alright, we're going to do this before we end the video. Uh, or whatever this is. I'm not supposed to mention that it's multiple parts and it makes it harder to, um, to do things. Oh, searching. Alright, so it's in this just general area. Hmm. This looks suspicious to me. Hello. Oh, this. Seems they'll let just about anyone drive an air taxi these days. <laughs> the hooligan who passed by before almost crashed into that building. What? Where were they? Alright. Which building? Ma'am, there's a lot of buildings around here. Time to murder. This is the. Uh, this is an appropriate massacre that I'm about to do. Alright, federal building. Okay, so. These people will, like, try to. Okay, annoyed Asquatch. Presumably, it had something to do with this. Oh! Alright, so, it, so it's up here. Use that to destroy. Okay! Alright, okay, so it's not just alternative form. This is good. This is this is good. maybe because I'm not I, I can't judge the game obviously by just episode one because uh, that would be unfair. I will harness this against the Jedi. I like Darth Maul. Darth Maul's a cool character, but he's like he's like Boba Fett. But it's, it's Star Wars. Leave your thoughts on the in the comments. Is Star Wars the chief franchise where it's like there's a lot of like really cool looking characters but the, 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 they probably wouldn't be cool if you heard that wait no you're not supposed to no no get out of the timeline you can't actually exist yet lad okay who do i complain to about a crazy air taxi if it weren't for my tuka cat like reflexes it would have knocked me down to us crew oh, oh screw it okay well unfortunately me and all the other children play this don't understand your expanded universe bs um, apparently there is some... This is child's play, yeah, I don't think I can open it. Oh. Alright, well, I definitely need to use it. No, it doesn't... It shouldn't tell me where I can put stuff. That'll make that other guy mad. The guy that wants Lego games to be built out of the British brown. Where am I going? I just need to find someone else. Are you after that crazy taxi? Why is everyone like English? I was just about to Coruscante. Mind, <laughs> oh, that's also what they're called. So, all yours. <laughs> all yours, okay. Why do the clones exist? Also, can you like can you like change the time period for like the galaxy? So like so like this will be more imperially and more evilly in like the the originals. <laughs> Where do you fellas want to go next? Sky's the limit now. Can I just... What do you want? Uh, if you want to ride in this deluxe, one of a kind. Compare. In this deluxe? Then beat it! We ain't bringing the taxi in a dock if... No, oh, okay. Oh, I need to. I need to cough up studs. What do you... I thought the Coruscant... Coruscanti didn't pay at terrorism. Nice. Then we got a deal. And by that I mean, we got a deal with some busybody with more money than sense. <laughs> Taxi fit, really? That deserves like a boss fight. Can't I just like kill them once? <laughs> Alright, that's a good effect. I shouldn't like... Can't... Darth Maul is probably powerful enough just to be able to like lift the taxi out of the sky and like explode it. Or just calmly put it down, you never know. But yeah, I think it's definitely a positive, and it, it makes it seem like the... How did she beat me? Where is she? Oh, there she is. 
<laughs> Makes it seem like this game's gonna have a lot more things happen in later episodes, which I guess would make sense. You don't, you don't want to make it too crazy like in the Phantom Menace, because it'll, it'll make you overwhelmed. It'll make you, it'll make you go the fuck. This, this shouldn't have be happening. Oh, you idiot. Don't come down here. Get off. My taxi. You found it. I best return this to the depot before my manager finds out it was missing. I'm off to make some crazy money. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right, we've got Lumar, Lumar in the Unduli. Unduli. Okay, it was worth it for the Unduli. All right, well that's gonna be the end. <sighs> gonna finish. We're gonna stop recording. This was the end of Star Wars Episode One. Also, he should not be snarling. Okay, well at most he should be snarling. He shouldn't even be furrowing his brow. I think he should just be like, "I'm cold. I'm unmoving. I'm gonna do a. I'm gonna. Oh, this isn't for being." Oh, this is a, it's an Empire Switch, so. Uh, are there any more characters I can buy? Can I buy... Oh, I had to buy him? What? Why? I don't even... I don't even understand anymore. Yeah, next... Next time we're gonna be... Get out of here. And we're gonna be going to... Where is it again? <laughs> episode 2, probably. Um, episode 2 or 4. If you care. How has this gone on for 30 more minutes? This is this has been 15 more minutes than what I thought. Didn't really intend that, but yeah. If you really care, use, use hashtag skimbly... Bim. <laughs> the microphone slammed into me. Use hashtag Skimbly Bim for um, episode four, and use hashtag uh, Unfunny for <laughs> for episode two. All right, that's it. Make sure to like. Oh fuck! I, I did the joke wrong, but I can't. I, I, I it's just built into my brain. I can't not say like the oh, fuck. I have absolutely nothing funny to end this on. So. Um. <laughs>